The Inspector General of Police, James Opon Bueno, says for the first time, the service has no backlog of cases against any officer at Police Intelligence and Professional Standards Bureau. At the opening ceremony of the National Anti-Corruption Action Plan, a program here in Accra, IGP said cases involving officers have been expeditiously dealt with. Here's a report by Godfrey Tadam. The latest Afrobarometer report released by the Center for Democratic Development, among others, indicated that four in ten people who had contact with key public services in 2019 paid a bribe to avoid problems with the police. 39% said they paid bribe to obtain police assistance. Almost consistently, the police has been on top of corruption perception index in the country, a situation that the police service is not pleased with. It has therefore implemented some strategies to deal with corruption in the service, hence the implementation of the National Anti-Corruption Action Plan, NACAP. The National Anti-Corruption Action Plan, NACAP, constitutes Ghana's framework to drive anti-corruption activities for the next 10 years. It is a contribution towards the fight against corruption and the promotion of national development. The Ghana Police Service is implementing the plan to put the service in a position of trust. Deputy Commissioner of Strage, Richard Akomkwesen, urged the police to build strong strategies to fight corruption. If the police service can, can bring forward its passion to enhance integrity in the service, to address issues of perception of corruption and even actual corruption within the police service, it will help a lot. The Inspector General of Police, James Opombuenu, urge the public to support the police to fight corruption in the service. The service has strengthened its disciplinary measures to ensure that personnel who get themselves involved in corrupt practices are severely dealt with. For the very first time in the history of the Ghana Police Service, the Central uh, Disciplinary Board of the service has had no backlogs. Unlike the days when an officer could get involved in a situation, he's either interdicted or he's on suspension or um, his case is pending and the file can be here for five, six years. NACAP comprises seven key components including examining corruption in the global and national context. 